everybody, welcome back to our channel. I'm Shalisa. In today's video, we're gonna be reviewing the Andis Pulse ZR2 Clipper. Okay, so I wanted to show you guys what comes in the box. It comes in this hard case, which is perfect for traveling. It comes with the clipper itself, the base, the power cord, clipper oil, and a blade drive. It also comes with a 10 blade. Now this clipper weighs in at about one pound, 10 ounces. It's eight inches long and it's powered by a lithium ion battery. It has a three hour runtime and it is designed to recharge hundreds of times. It has an adjustable five speed. Ranging at about 25 to 4,500 strokes per minute. It comes in black, purple, and floral. Now I just wanted to give you guys my honest opinion and my pros and cons for this clipper. So starting with the pros, my first pro is that it is a heavy duty clipper. This clipper will tear through any coat type, starting from your pre-shaving matted doodle coat to the finishing work. So for my second pro, I wanted to say it does have an indicator light, so it does tell you before the clipper actually dies. Now, when you turn it on, it does glow green when it's fully charged. Now, when it starts to die, it goes from green to yellow to an amber color all the way to red before it completely shuts off. For my third pro, it does have a detachable battery. So that's always a plus to have when you can remove this battery and charge it and then place in your other battery so you can keep grooming. If I can put this back in. There we go. Nope. So for my fourth pro, it is a five speed clipper. Now this thing can go from grooming a dog all the way to grooming a horse to shearing a sheep. So if that tells you any kind of power, this thing can get the job done. Now for my last pro, for being a five speed clipper, it is much quieter than most cordless clippers. So that's always a plus when working around animals. Now moving on to the cons list. My first con, it is a five speed clipper. I personally don't use all five speeds. I would say I use about three. So for me, having all five speeds just adds more weight and cost. Now for my second con, this is heavy. She comes in at about one pound, 10 ounces. And for my third con, the clipper doesn't come with a rubber grip. It's just a hard plastic all around. Now. When I'm grooming, if a dog knocks this out my hand, it's gonna go flying. So I personally would like at least a rubber grip on it just so I have something to grab onto. They do sell sleeves, attachment sleeves that you can put on, but that just is another cost. So that's shitty. And for my last con is the cost. Now this clipper runs at about 350 to 380, depending on what company you're buying it from. And that's just the clipper itself. They do sell spare batteries that run at about $100. So in total, that's $450 to $480. And honestly, that's just an investment. Now moving on to the four paw rating system. As you saw in our Oster review with Christy, we gave you guys the rundown. So Christy, give us the rundown on the categories for today. What rating do you give it for durability? Durability, I'm gonna give it a four paw. Ergonomical. Uh, three paws. Noise. Three paws. Weight. Mm, three paws. Price. I would say two and a half paws. Overall, the Andis Pulse ZR2 Clipper got a three paw rating, which is amazing. This clipper is a heavy duty clipper. It gets the job done, but like I said, it is an investment. So I hope you guys found this video helpful. Like always, please like, share, and subscribe, and don't forget to hit that notification bell. And we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.